what conversations will engage your attention. Can you present yourself, introduce yourself? Therefore, the courage is there to say, throw everything out, and then, because there is something which cannot be thrown out. If you find that, everything else can be thrown out, and everything else can stay at the same time. It makes no difference. There is nothing in this existence that you have to move half an inch to be what you are. There is nothing to heal, or to change, or fix, or reach, or leave, or manipulate to be what you are. There is no steps to take if your eyes are really open. You are already that. But something else must happen. That which is sucking at your attention, you must identify what this is. Because there is belief in that. And that is always closing the curtains for you. These closing and opening curtains mean nothing for you. If you don't decide to look out, then what does it mean to open and close curtains for you? What can be behind any curtain? Whatever can be revealed there, hmm? you are earlier than that, because it is you who will witness it. Who sees this? Which you am I talking about? Huh? What language? Um, what culture do you belong to? What gender? There is something, I am calling it something, it is not a thing. I call it the informationless being, unassociated. Is it in recognition of itself in this moment? The informationless being, meaning no information can, is required by itself. It need not associate with anything. There is nothing to associate with. There is no with for it. There is no and for it. There is no but for it. There is no when. There is no how. There is no if. Where is it? Any distance? Any distance to cover? Habit tells us, no, it cannot be so easy what you are talking. I have to do something. I have to sacrifice something. I have to meditate. I have to do something. But the very doing of anything is appearing in you. Can any activity return you to you? You without you, you without the noise of identity. You cannot be that because you are a witness of that. I wonder if my words are confusing for you. No. They always fail, the words. They are only useful at pointing but they cannot convey. The pointing finger cannot touch what is being pointed at. And what is being pointed at is what is being pointed from at the same time. What kind of mystery is this?
you're so complete in your own satisfaction you had to create some dissatisfaction in order to taste uh, multiplicity there's a silence in you where does it come from this silence which is in you now, uh, what can remove it? What work does it have to do? It will swallow up everything. For these questions, the mind has nothing to offer you, cannot help you. All you can do is to ignore it, leave that. Because the mind is longing to introduce you to incompleteness, to separation, to work, to sacrifice, all these things. So I am very thankful for your question. Are you satisfied for the moment or something more? Yes, thank you. Very great. Thank you. <laughs> you are who? You are what? What is the evidence of you? Is this body the evidence of who you are?